Hey everyone, welcome to my video. In this video, we are going to be modeling this handle model. Let's start then. Uh, we are just going to open a new part, and in front plane, we will create our center line. Firstly, uh, this is a basic line with line commands, which is create a profile like this. The dimensions is 60 millimeter high. Distance from here to here 111. And from this point to this point, uh, highness is 25.3 millimeter. And this dimension 136 millimeter. We have uh, radiuses on the corners. First, we are going to create them. Then, 36 millimeter here, 30 millimeter here, and last radius is going to be 12 millimeter on this uh, corner. Yes, we create basically our uh, uh, center profile, and then. We are just going to create here a uh, circle which is 35 millimeter and we open a refer uh, under reference reference geometry we open a plane plane will be on uh, this uh, point basically I choose the line and then the ending point and the same diameter will be also here this diameter uh, 35 millimeter. We finished our profile, sec uh, center profile, and uh, the uh, diameters sections for uh, loft. Now we're just going to create outer uh, guide curves. Uh, basically, we start with the line, and then with same line, I'm coming to when the line active I'm coming to point back and automatically my radius here starting and again I go back to point I took this uh, radius and now I have again a line when I go back to point program give, gives me again an arc and I'm completing my profile this uh, point going to be appears on the uh, my uh, section this point on this uh, profile uh, dimensions is uh, radius 200 radius 60 and uh, radius 40 I have a radius here 30 Third radius, and now we are going to give the dimensions from origin to here 147 millimeter. And I don't have here a tangency, I give tangency relation. And from the here to the other point, I create a construction geometry. This is a, a line we made a horizontal and dimension from here to there is 78 millimeter uh, as you see everything is dark and then uh, that means we have to find sketch fully the the last guide curve uh, here and then I go back to point I took radius and I come back to this point sometimes it is hard to get back reverse radius then we just leave it like that I create here a line and we go continue up and I come back the point and I have here a radius this radius already here tangent and we are going to make piers we are going to make in this point piers and with a one arc I go connect to radius to each other 
Uh, this uh, radius value is 210 millimeter. Uh, this radius is 13. This is 10 millimeter. The uh, dimension from here to uh, here 108 millimeter should be, if I'm right. Uh, no, from here to here 108 millimeter and probably yeah there is something missing here and uh, lowest po point on the arc uh, this point to this area is 37 millimeter uh, do you, if you want to give this dimension you should press the shift button first the choosing a point and then the shift button you're going to able to give the, this dimension and uh, I must check one more point 108 and 37 we are still having something's not yeah fully defined this two point also going to be uh, vertical in the uh, x uh, axis and last thing here uh, radius <coughs> sorry uh, this is going to be yeah 12 sorry yeah basically we create everything now loft uh, to section center line parameters and we choose this center line if there is something missing I don't think so again Profile five one profile two center line parameters. This is our center line, and now I go choose my guide curves. As you see, my whole model is done, and uh, I am now uh, creating our uh, hand grip. Uh, uh, cuts. Uh, the first will be from here to here. We are going to create a line. This line 75 millimeter. Firstly, I have here a profile like this. Uh, when I have one x uh, center line and two line, I can make basically symmetric this dimension will be 75 millimeter and I have two radius and uh, this dimension to here is uh, 70 millimeter and uh, I go create the other one other one will be here and basically form will be like this these two is uh, parallel this two is parallel and the dimension uh, the angle with will, will be 70 this guy don't have enough dimension to uh, be uh, fully defined for that reason I just created there a construction geometry making horizontal and then making this two point on this uh, construction geometry it's symmetric and uh, my dimension here will be uh, 75 but we will uh, give some radius on the corners this radius will be much more smaller everything is done now we just having a split line we split it our uh, surface then uh, with offset command we create two time uh, surface like it's a kind of copy this will be only the outer uh, one millimeter the same command when you enter it's, it comes back this is also here uh, one millimeter our uh, radius on the corner 0 
this radius here again 0 0.75 and I have three body and uh, basically we just go give some color to uh, make our model a little bit uh, making handsome I say like that and yeah this is going to be this color and some extra radius yes yeah this is all uh, it's uh, I hope it's an, a nice uh, model for you uh, many years before I have seen this uh, hand uh, hand bar and uh, that's why I want to make a new model again it's a good example for loft and some basic surface uh, commons I hope you enjoyed if you like my video please don't forget to make comment and like my video uh, if you are going to support me a lot I will have more time to create uh, much more better uh, videos examples thank you again for watching